Hey everybody, it's Ryan at livingonehanded.com. I wanted to review a couple things for you from tombin.com. They sent me a couple of NYX minimalist wallets. I had a different wallet for like years and it kind of disintegrated, so I needed something new and they just came out with these. Um, and so I've been using mine for a few months now. Um, so I thought it'd be a great time to tell you what I went with and show you a couple of different designs. So um, the first one I'm gonna show you is NYX minimalist wallet, it's number three. They have four different styles. Um, this one, so you can see here, is blue. You can see that it's small. And inside, it has two pockets. So there's a, uh, a pocket on this side with the material, and a pocket on this side with a clear, uh, like, urethane window here, all right? So I have cards in both of these here. I don't think any of my numbers are showing, so that's great. Um, there's also this little elastic loop here. Um, and that is, if you want to close it, and then you put that lip loop around it, there you go. So now you have it shut, and it's not going anywhere. Um, there's really no structure to these. It's just the material, and so the structure comes from whatever you have inside of it. So I just have cards in here. Um, for this one, I have on the urethane side, I have one, two, I have three different cards that are in there. And then on the other side, I have two different cards that are in there. Um, and so this wallet is great. It also has a little pocket on the outside. Um, so you can put, you know, let's say you put some cash in there or whatever you want to put in there. Um, so this one is great. This is not the one that I chose to use. Um, the, the urethane one, it, it gets a little bit sticky. Um, so if you put your license in there, that's totally fine. You can see it. But I found like even when you go places, they still make you take it out anyway. Um, and so that's one of those things that it's a, a nice feature um, if you have something that you need people to see. But a lot of times I ask you to take it out anyway. Uh, but other than that, <coughs> cool little wallet. I do really like it. Uh, but what I did is I went with the ultra minimalist NYX wallet. And I went with the number one. Uh, and it is just simply a black <laughs> material. Uh, there's no window. It's just two pockets on the inside. There's no pocket on the outside. Again, there's no structure to it um, other than what you put inside of it. Um, and so mine right now I have on one side uh, my debit card, my license, my insurance cards. And that's on one side. And on the other side I have what? One, two, three three cards and my old insurance cards. <laughs> so I can probably take those out. Uh, but again, super simple. Has the uh, elastic loop here for when you go uh, and you wanna put, hold it together. Um, so now here's the deal. I love both of them. They're both great. Um, the only thing for me that I would say, um, I'd like maybe a little bit more structure. Um, it doesn't matter all that much. It's not something I think about. Um, but it would be kind of nice at just the, the look of it. Like you can see mine is a little bit like, it's just not super symmetrical. I know that's picky, but <laughs> it's just one of those things. Um, also this little loop here, um, I, I don't ever use it just to be honest. I don't, uh, I'm thinking about cutting it off, but I probably want to just leave it. Um, but it's something that it's, it's more trouble than it's worth. Honestly, for me, um, it, it stays together anyway when I put it in my pocket. When I come out, having one hand, it's just kind of a pain to undo and get that out. And then put it back like that, right? Like it's just kind of a pain. So I don't really use that. Um, <clears throat> the other thing is, if you have too much in here, um, too many cards or whatever, it can be challenging um, with one hand to actually get stuff out of it. Um, so like pulling out a card you know, and finding the card and pulling it out. Um, it can be a little bit of a challenge, but the material is nice and um, slick. I mean, they come out fine. Um, it's just a matter of, if you only have one hand, trying to brace it and then pull something out um, can be a little bit difficult. The only other thing that, uh, again, it isn't a deal breaker, but like I have one of my cards here for living one-handed. Say I get a business card and I want to just stick it in my wallet. It doesn't, it doesn't fit. It fits like credit card size things, but it does not fit regular business cards for the most part. Some of them I've been able to get in, some of them not. And like if I really try to jam it in, like you can see it's just, it's just not quite there. 
and I, I can't, I was going to try to jam it in, but it kind of, yeah, it's all bending in here. So you can see it's like all bent up. <laughs> so that's one drawback. Again, it's not a deal breaker, but if you're a business card person, um, they, they aren't going to fit in here. So maybe that's something that when they uh, make the next round or something, they make it a touch bigger so that business cards can fit in here. But as of right now, they don't. So uh, like I said, that's it. The next minimalist one is what I went with. And like I said, I love it. Super slim, uh, easy to use, a uh, couple things about getting cards out, um, uh, the little strap here, maybe you'll like that, that'd be great. Uh, and then the other one, number three, uh, with the window and the pocket. Uh, and so there, like I said, there are a couple other styles on there. So to head over to dombin.com and take a look for yourself and uh, pick out the one that you think will work for you. If you have any questions about either of these, um, or if maybe you have some and you want to give your insight to, leave comments below. Otherwise, thank you for watching and I hope you found it helpful. Thank you.